Okay, I gotta do this again. It cut off on me. Glad I didn't. Do, glad I didn't do it in the middle of um when I was doing the NFL pickup. Uh, it's almost just about time for the aftermath uh, of week three, I would say. And I've already did the week four, uh, because I do not know if I was my stay was gonna be extended because I thought my treatment and my assessment was gonna start yesterday. But no, like I did when I did my call, everything was a hurry up and wait. Hurry up and wait. After you do your calls, hurry up and wait. Or wait for what? Wait for what? Better be glad I wasn't waiting for a transplant because, you know, people die waiting for transplants every day. And it's ridiculous. It's absolutely ridiculous. So... I think I have another good week as far as as far as my predictions is concerned. At least that is concerned. I've already done week four. <sighs> Hopefully, I can start my treatment soon because I think I might have to need another more time here because not no telling where if I have to wind up going back to Houston, what's going to go down. Uh so I don't, I don't, I don't even know. I don't even know. I, uh, mm. I don't even know. It's a hurry up and wait, and then we're right in the barrel of a government shutdown, potential government shutdown, and especially Trump wanting it because he supported because of the gov- uh the Republicans don't have a good deal, all that crap, and then he's gonna miss another debate. He's not even gonna speak in another debate. Uh. Yeah, so he's not going to. So this is two debates that the the uh, uh, president Trump missed. And how is he the front runner? How is he a front runner? And that's two debates that he's not going not he's not going to attend. Um, at the I think it's at the Ronald Reagan Library. Yeah, at the Ronald Reagan Library. So I don't I don't know what's going on. I I. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe with the name recognition, you can you can skip debate. Is that how that works? If you have enough, money? well, I'm pretty sure the Rock can skip debate because uh, a lot of wrestling fans, including myself, know who the Rock is, or even some movie fans know who the Rock is, like the Scorpion King, Jumanji, and some of the other films that he been appearing in. So I'm pretty sure he'll have comp blanche to not do those two debates, the first one and the second one. Yeah, uh, I think I was in a pass split one of the uh during the first one. Either a pass split or a hotel. I don't know what what happened, but I don't know. I don't know. Uh, eerie, eerie, strange, eerie, strange. This world is crazy, crazy. Well, day four at a um at a mental facility and haven't got tested yet. Haven't seen the doctor yet, haven't anything yet. But when I did my call, it's a hurry up and wait. You know, after I waited a, a long time to get a person, and then now after I talk to them, you know, plead my case and everything like that, it's a hurry up and wait. Hurry up and wait, hurry up and wait. For what? With nowhere to go. Really? I'm being bullied over here. I'm, I'm really being bullied right now. This is my life. This is my life. I mean, this is ridiculous. This is my reality. This is reality you want me to live in? Well, if this is the reality that, that you want me to live in, I don't want it. Take me to fantasy land. I'll be the mayor. I'll, hell, I'll be, the, I'll be the president of fantasy land. I don't want it. I don't want it. Not only I don't have another wife, I'm penniless. I'm homeless. I'm fighting for my life, fighting for my mental health. For what? For what? So that money could be spent to your plane? For what? So you could have a government shutdown again? But this time under under a worse president, President Biden? For what? For what? For what? Anyway, let me go ahead and do the NFL pickup. Uh, anyway, oh, come on, you mean I have to start again? I didn't even do the song. Oh, come on.
Come on, I want to do this before lunch. Come on. Now I have to start over. I had to literally had to update everything, but I had to. I was worried about the. Uh, okay, uh, now I could do the song for YouTube. This is for YouTube. Uh, I have the song for everybody else on the podcasting. Uh, it's the aftermath of week three in the NFL pickup. Not in Galveston, but in Texas City. It's the NFL pickup. On the big D zone. Yeah. That's right. Who would have thought that I would have to be going back to the mainland. And well that was a failed exile. That was failed. Anyway. Week three. Uh, so this was a doozy. It was a Thursday night, uh, Thursday night game. And already got a, a win up. Uh, because I said it was a double down. And it was, uh, the final score was 30, yeah, 30 to 12. So, that was the 49ers versus the New York Giants. That was the Thursday night game. And the rest of this game is Sunday until we get to the Monday night affair. Alright, so, so, one win, one loss right about now because for some reason... The Lions won again. Oh, Malachi must be really happy right now. He must have said he got the last laugh. But I'm still not going to pick the Lions to uh, for a double down. Any other team that plays against the Lions is going to be a ride or die from now on. Whether I get a win or a loss, they're going to get a they're going to be a ride or die because I'm not picking the Lions no more. Not, not. But they win another game. First, they win the game against the Chiefs, which was a fluke. And now they get another fluke over the Falcons. And on top of that, the final score was 20-6? to six? Uh-uh. Uh-uh. No, 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 no. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. That is completely bullshit. Completely bullshit, 20-6. to six. Come on. All right. Oh. No. Chargers? The Chargers? I didn't pick the Chargers. They wasn't my pick. I didn't pick the Chargers. Now it was a low-scoring game, but still, I didn't pick the Chargers. I picked the Vikings. But they lost 24 to 26. So now I'm two, I'm only at one on one win for the week and two losses already. Well, this might turn around. This is going to turn around. Uh, this was a double down with the Saints versus the Packers. And and a lot of these low score in the fair thing. What's going on? Boy. Anyway. Uh, oh, this one is like one point. This is like by one point. The Packers beat the Saints by 18 to 17. This is a one point game. One point. All right, so okay, now we're getting now we're getting so it's, I had I had two two wins and two losses. Now I'm going to get a third win. Uh, thank you, Texan, Houston, Texas, which uh another one of my teams, uh, by the score of thirty-seven to seventeen, and uh yeah, so they beat the Jack the Jacksonville Jaguars. So thank you, Dad. And I want to stop. And talk about this. Oh, brother. Oh, brother. I mean, I was watching YouTube. And a, 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 even a Houston news station was carrying, was talking about some of the Denver Broncos players was in disarray over an embarrassing loss to none other than the Miami Dolphins. Now, I know I said that this was a double down, but I expect this to be a total blowout. I mean, this, I, you can't even make up words for this. Wait, this is a basketball? Okay, okay, okay. This is the NFL, not the NBA. The Dolphins, 
I kid you not. I shit you not. The Dolphins beat the Broncos by the score of, hold on to your hats. And I can't believe this is the first NFL pickup that I'm saying this. They beat the Broncos by the score of 70. 70 to 20. Okay. I may have autism, but I did not stutter. I did not stutter. You heard me correctly. I said 70 to 20. But uh, what? What? I could. Uh, I thought we. But it was weird. Okay, okay. Is it going to be. The 2023 season is going to be a weird season. I thought week week one was weird. I didn't know week three was going to be weird. 70 to 20. The Dolphins just literally destroyed the Broncos. They was destroyed. This is not the NBA. I couldn't believe I had to read the score on, on, on the NFL pickup. 70 to 20. Is that for real? Was that for real? Oh my land! I got, I, I, I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. Have the Dolphins just been getting nothing but touchdowns? Is that is that that what it is? If they keep getting nothing but touchdowns over the Denver Broncos, really? I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. Anyway, wow, wow, wow. Uh, here's another one. Yeah, week three is strange. This is the strangest week week uh, week three. So, I know I got a double down win, but I guess wait, how many wins did I have? I had okay. So Thursday was a win, then two loss on the uh, on the Sunday game. So two loss. Yeah, yeah, two. Three, so it's three wins, four wins, and one of them was the weird one. So the fourth one was a weird one, uh, and then this is the fifth. This will be the fifth win. So yeah, I only got two. Yeah, I only got one. Oh my god, yeah, I only got two losses so far. But wow, uh, twenty-seven to three, Browns versus the Titans. Wow, this is the you see, this is the reason why I do, this crap like this is the reason why I do double down. Crap, especially crap of what happened at the Brown uh the Broncos versus Dolphins game. That is the reason why I do double down. Wow. Wow, unbelievable. Unbelievable. Twenty seven to only three. Titans wasn't even in the building. Not even in the building. There's another team that did show up. But I got to say this. Thank you, Bills. And I did find out way before I was uh, getting ready prepared for the NFL pickup this week of the aftermath. Uh, thanks to Chief Justice because uh, Chief Justice is a huge fan of the Bills, by the way. Uh, so, I mean, we literally embarrassed the worst naming team in the history of the NFL. We, we handed them... Their first, uh, I think it's their first or the second loss. Or I don't even know what's going on, but we handed them their their one of their losses by the score of thirty seven to three. And I say it again until I'm blue in the face: the Commanders are the worst team in the NFL, the worst. But thank you, Bills. Thank you, thank you. All right, the Colts and the Ravens beat. Uh, the Colts beat the Ravens by the score of 22 to 19. So that will be my seventh win. Okay. So two two losses and seven wins. Okay, I'll take that any day of the weeks. Okay, make that three losses. Three losses and seven wins. Thanks to, you guessed it, my March nemesis, the Patriots. Well, one of my March nemesis. And, uh, well, a normal low-scoring affair, uh, 15 to 10. Wow. 
I don't know what to think. This might be a weird football year, if you tell me. Okay, so I'm back up. I got eight wins now. So, so three, three to eight. Uh, Panthers were taking on the Seahawks. The Seahawks beat, uh, beat the Panthers by the score of 37-27. Okay. Uh, well, win number nine. Yeah, win number nine. Three to, uh, three to nine. Cause the Brown, no, I can't, I can't even think after that Dolphins versus, uh, poof. Wow. I can't even think. I can't even think. But the Bears versus the Chiefs. Uh, the Chiefs came up on top. My still one of my official teams in the uh, in uh, in uh, football by the score of forty one to ten. So that would be my ninth win. Okay, here's ten. So it's ten three. Uh, but the Cardinals beat the Cowboys by the score of twenty six sixteen. So, boy, this is why I'm doing double downs. I, now it's fourth. Oh, boy, I don't want to be wind up getting tied. So, it's like, okay, so it's like 10, 10, 3, but now it's 10, yes, yeah, it's, it's 10, 10, 3. Uh, the Steelers and the Raiders took the field, but uh, the Steelers came on top by the score of 23-18. So, I am 10-3. Make that 11-3. I said I had a ride to die with the Eagles versus uh, Tom Brady and Buccaneers, but I just call it Tom Brady. Yes, the Eagles actually beat Tom Brady. Thank you, Eagles. Uh, so it's 11-3 uh, for the week, but the final score of the game is the uh, is 25-11. to 11. Now here is my... Um, uh, 12th win, thanks to the Bengals. My ride or die. Thank you, Bengals. Uh, 19 to 16. So, my final for the week is 11 to 3. 11 wins, 3 losses. So, still pretty good. Still pretty, pretty good, but I'm still shocked over the fact about the, uh, uh, the Broncos versus the, uh, Dolphins and the 70. The twenty went. I still can't fathom. I I still can't believe that I actually had to say seventy to twentieth. What the hell was that? What was that? That threw me off. That threw me off. That really threw me off. Peace. I guess. <laughs>